TV film movie. Hey guys, it's Jay and today I'm here with my May favorites for 2019. I actually have quite a few things this month to talk about so we're just gonna jump right into it so that this video is not 20 minutes long. So without further ado, let us get started. So usually how I start off the video is with like events or like activities I really enjoyed this month. This month I went to a wine and paint night with my mom and my boyfriend's mom and it was the first one I've ever been to and I created this beautiful masterpiece ho oh, ho ho i'm clearly not an artist but the one that my mom made was so good and i'm really bitter because your girl didn't know that she was an artist so i feel very inadequate because i did not get those jeans but that's okay i'll insert a picture so you guys can see what my mom's look like but it was a lot of fun i'd never been to one before basically you have wine and then you like get a blank canvas and there's a picture and they like break it down step by step how to make this picture and you create masterpieces. I'm definitely trying to bribe my mom to go to another one with me because I had so much fun with it so we'll see if there will be another canvas that you'll see one day. Next I'll talk about my clothing items I guess that I really love this month. So first is the hat that I'm wearing. It is Little Stitch. I love Stitch. It's one of my favorite Disney movies. And then it also says cute and fluffy on the back. And I think it is like literally the cutest thing ever. So I've been loving that. I actually like just bought it the other day. So like it's an end of the May favorites. And then the other clothing item I have is actually like the jacket that I'm wearing. It's an OP jacket. It was actually my mom's when she was a teenager. So the jacket's like over 30 years old, but I'm obsessed with it. I love it so much. I love the rainbow. And it's like the perfect like spring jacket because it's like really thin but it also like makes you sweat if that makes sense. But I really like it because my mom put these little toggles on it. One Snoopy and one's Woodstock. And I just am a big fan of this jacket, okay? The next two things are going to be like movie TV shows. The first is the TV show Chambers. It's on Netflix. It is so good and I highly recommend it. It's about this teenager who ends up having a heart attack and then she gets a heart transplant from this girl named Becky and then she starts like seeing things and it's basically her trying to solve the death of Becky and it's just like it's crazy it's a thrill ride I watched it in like two days with my mom so definitely check out Chambers because it is underrated and I want a season two so more people need to watch it okay thank you and then the other tv film movie thing that I loved this month was the new live action for Aladdin. I was definitely not expecting to like it as much as I did but I came out of that theater and I couldn't stop singing Friend Like Me or Prince Ali. I think that Will Smith did such a good job as the genie. I was like a little bit hesitant because of Robin Williams and like my love for that movie. It's probably my second favorite movie other than The Lion King. So I had big expectations and they were fulfilled. Highly recommend y'all check it out. It was really good. Super catchy songs. They added new songs. I also liked how they didn't really follow the storyline in the end. It kind of changed and Jasmine was more like badass. Jasmine was a lot more like doing things for herself instead of waiting for the prince, which I really liked. So highly recommend y'all check that out. That segues into my next topic, which are like things that I like this month. So I um, bought a lot of Funko Pops once I saw the movie and um, they're all Aladdin. Are we surprised? But the first one is from like the Disney version of it. It's little Abu because I've been wanting Abu for the longest time. I call my best friend Abby Abu so it's kind of a joke about that but also I just really like Aladdin so I finally have a little Abu. And then the other four are all from the live action movie. So I got Princess Jasmine. I've been looking for like the Disney animated version of her and haven't been able to find her anywhere. So now I have a live action one, which I really liked her in that movie. She was so pretty. Oh my god. And then I also picked up Jafar with his little staff. And I picked up Will Smith as the genie, which again, I thought he did an amazing job. So... I really, really am excited that I have this now. And then I also picked up Aladdin with Abu. And I was like super excited because they were at Hot Topic for buy one, get one, one dollar. So usually this whole thing would be like $80, $100, but your girl got it for like $50. And that's also because I bought this hat. So really 
I think it was like $30, which like four pops for $30? Yes, please. And then I also have like two Lion King-esque things. The first is this cross stitch that my mother made. Can we just take in how talented my mother is? Stay in, she's not an artist. Again, liar. But it's like the Akuna Matata scene and she made it in like purples and blues because those are my favorite colors. Well, purple is, but blue and purple go well together in this aspect. But I just love it so much. I'm gonna end up getting it framed and I'm gonna hang it somewhere in my room. Who knows where because I don't have any wall space, but I'll find a spot for it. And then the other thing is my necklace that I'm wearing. I literally just bought this today, but I'm obsessed with it. It's a little Simba, like you know when Rafiki draws it on the cave wall? It's that in rose gold, so it matches my ring and I'm here for it. I love it so much. It's a little tight because I'm pretty sure it's a children's necklace but I don't care. And finally, for my favorite part of the video where I get to lip sync terribly to songs that I've been loving this month. I honestly could go on and on about songs that I've been loving this month, but I'm only going to play two. The first one is obviously the new John Bellion song. It's actually not his song, it's Elenium. He's like a DJ kind of guy, but it's John Bellion's vocals. So I'm counting it as John Bellion's song, but it's called All Good Things Fall Apart and I'm obsessed with it, so here. It is. Overthinking, it's got me drinking, listen with my head. Tell me what you're hiding from my head. Oh, you're really so sorry. Oh, yeah. Coming to terms with a broken heart, I guess that sometimes good things fall apart. That night when we fall out of the window, the oppressed friend. He's just like my favorite singer in the entire world and I just love his voice and his music. He's so underrated, you all need to listen to John Bellion, please. And then the next song that I've been loving is a new artist I just discovered, had no idea who he was. His name is Russ Diamond and this is his song Civil War and I heard it and I'm obsessed with it now, so here it is. <laughs> I just think it's like super catchy and when I was listening to it, I was in a fight with my boyfriend so like I was like, call my phone bitch, you know? So, relatable, but I really like that song. Definitely check out his music, I think he's really fun. Alright guys, so that was my May favorites for 2019. Let me know down below a couple of things that you've been loving this month and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye!